Right. Glub, 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 glub. I'm coming, I'm coming. No breaks. Watch out. <laughs> Basket, are you okay? Uh, I'm fine. Just need to practice my landing. Hey, guess what I've got today? What could it be? Come along with me. One, two, three. A camera. That's right. Who wants to be a photographer? Me, me, I would. Uh, what's a photographer? A uh, photographer is someone who takes pictures using a camera. I'm in. Oh, can we take pictures of fish? Sure. There are photographers who take pictures underwater. Just grab onto my handles and we'll go on an undersea photo mission. Hi ho! Off we go! Whoa! We're in a submarine. I'll be the photographer and take the pictures. What about me? You'll be the assistant photographer. You can help Abby. Now, your job is to get a picture of a rare red moonfish. You help us to find the red fish, too. Let's go. I see a fish. Hurry, Abby, take the picture. That's a fish. But is it the right color? No, it's yellow. We need to find a red one. Oh, there's a red fish. Actually, that's not a fish. That's an octopus. Oh, <laughs> right. Fish have tails and fins. Yeah, and they go glub, glub, glub. <laughs> yeah, glub, glub. There it is! There it is! It's a red moonfish. Good work, assistant photographer Rudy. Now, I need something to help hold the camera still. How about this? That's called a tripod. Perfect! Thanks, assistant photographer Rudy. Here goes. Uh, uh, oh, oh, he moved. I only got half of him. And it's not really his good half. Where'd he go? He's right over there. Oh, he's so far away and blended into the rocks. I can hardly see him. What do those ringy thingies do? You mean on the lens? I'll try turning them. Oh, it's getting closer. That's called zooming. Oh, no. Now it's blurry. Getting the right picture takes patience. Try again. Yeah, keep trying. You're right. I can't give up now. Ah, there it is. Oh, it's kind of dark. Wish there was more light on the fish. Oh, I know. What if I try using the submarine's headlights? Whoa. Good work, assistant photographer Rudy. Uh, maybe a little higher? Here goes. Ooh, that's better. I'll make sure I get all of them. All right, smile, fishy. Got him! You did it! Good job, photographers. You two are a really great team. Secret, Secret handshake. Up high, down low, yay, we did it! Way, Way to go! go. Uh-huh. Time to go home. Time to put everything away. Glub, glub. Glub, glub, glub. <laughs> I guess any picture Abby takes is magic. Well, gotta fly. See you soon. Bye, Basket. Here's a job for you. Be a 
photographer and find something red and take a picture of it. See you next time. On Abby's Amazing Adventure. Every night when I lie in bed, oh, no. I see pictures dancing in my head. Picture sleep. Buddy Bert. What? Buckle up and we'll fly away. Whoa. Yeah. We're adventuring. Every time the bed starts tapping, something special's gonna happen. This is kind of kicky. My favorite kind of traveling. Yeah. We're adventuring. Come along with Bert and Ernie. We're gonna take a little. Hey, Bert, we're all set to do some deep sea diving and find the eight-legged wonder. Uh, actually, honey, I think I'll sit out this dive if you don't mind. What do you mean, Bert? I, uh, have some important seaweed sorting to do, yeah. Okay, well, hurry up and do it and then come on in. You know, it won't be the same finding the eight-legged wonder without you, Bert. So I'll be waiting. Gang's away! doing down there? Ernie! Hey, Bert, what's keeping you? Come on, I need your help to find the eight-legged wonder. Oh, I'd love to help you, Ernie, but I'm too busy sorting all this seaweed. Uh, maybe in a little while? <sighs> okay, Bert, but, but hurry! to come see. I found something amazing too, Arnie. This piece of seaweed, both short and crinkly. Look at it. Oh, does that mean you're not coming in? Uh, uh, I don't think so, Arnie. Oh, Bert, you have no idea what you're missing. Tell you what, I'll go get my underwater camera and take a picture for you. Could you watch Rubber Ducky for a minute? Thanks. I... Sure, Ernie. Hmm. I guess I really let Ernie down. He wanted me to come in so badly. <sighs> if only the water wasn't so wet and watery. Right, Rubber Ducky? Rubber Ducky? Rubber Ducky? <gasps> Rubber Ducky! Oh no, he'll be lost at sea forever! I'll save you, Rubber Ducky! Don't worry, Bert is near! Uh, Bert is here! Bert is... in the water. I'm in the water. Look at me! I'm in the water! Hey, Bert? Bert? Those are Bert's footprints. Going into the water, Bert? Bert! <laughs> Wow! Oh, oh, uh, oh, Bert, you found the eight-legged wonder, too! Yeah, and the water's great, Arnie. Come on in! <laughs> uh, uh, oh. Hey, Mr. Eight-Legged Wonder, could you take a picture of all of us? Glub, glub, gladly! Everybody smile! <laughs>
Good night, bird. Good night, Ernie. A problem. No, we don't, Frankie. The sun's shining, the surf's up. We're having a beach blanket monster party. Yeah, yeah. Like, where's the problem? Yeah, yeah where, Frankie? Where, Frankie? Where, Frankie? It's in the ocean. Hey, huh? come on in and tell them about it, fish dude. Oh, fish dude. This, this is so uncool. The ocean is full of trash. Yeah, I can hardly swim. I'm so bummed. Look, I'm totally covered with it. It's bones. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. How did the trash get in the ocean, fish dude? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, dudette, people threw it there. That's oh. terrible. Yeah. We've got to stop them, Frankie. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, radical idea, yeah. Ned, but, but how? Yeah, how? Yeah. I know. We'll sing a song that tells people not to put trash in the ocean. Yeah. 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 I see the ocean, I get choked up with emotion, it's true. When I'm riding on my board, catching waves into the shore with you. I got a monster surfer dream, gotta keep the water clean and blue. So come on all around the world, let's do what surfing monsters do. Come on and love, love, love. Love the ocean, show respect for the sea. Be a friend to the water cause it's, it's a friend to you and me. Help to cure it, keep it pure from sea to sea to shine and see. When I see somebody litter, it sure puts me in a bitter mood. I say, hey, do what you ought to get that trash out of the water. Come on and love, 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 love the ocean, show respect for the sea, be a friend to the water, cause it's a friend to you and me, help to cure it, keep it pure from sea to sea to shine and see, yeah. love, 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 love the ocean, show respect for the sea, be a friend to the water, cause it's a friend. Excellent song, Monster Dudes. I hope people just be excellent and do what it says. We hope so too, little fish dude. Yeah, yeah me yeah. too. Oh, All right. Up. What? and a shrimp are about to be bowled over by a big problem. All right, Larry, put the pins down. You got it, Linda. <sighs> Where are they going? Oh, no. Oh, it looks like we're never going to be able to bowl underwater. Help! 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 Help!
my god, my 2.0! You showed up! Yes, even underwater, the super soggy superhero heeds the call for assistance. <sighs> now, what seems to be the problem? We're trying to do some bowling! But can't seem to keep the pins down. Hmm, perhaps you have faulty pins. But worry not, I shall unleash! Ah, my power of observation. <laughs> ah, let me see one of those. Yeah. Hmm. Looks hard and heavy. Perfect to move with. Ooh. Aha! Wow. Uh, my super senses observe it flew away. Well, uh, I think when something rises, it's called floating, Super Grover. Ah, then we simply need to keep the pins from floating away. Yeah. Hand me those, please. What are you going to do, Super Grover? I am going to hold these pins down. Yeah. All right, little shrimpy, bowl away. If you say so, Super Grover. I do. Oh, wait a minute. I do not want to get bowled over. Uh, oh, it didn't work. Mm, looks like we can't use pins to bowl underwater. So, the question is, what can you bowl with underwater that will not float away? Yeah, that's the question, all right. You got any suggestions? Let me check my utility sock. Aha! Perhaps we can use a banana. Will that work? I have no idea. We must unleash ah, the power of investigation. Will the banana sink or float? What is your hypothesis? Uh, uh what's up? A uh, hypothesis. A hypothesis is a thoughtful guess. So what is your hypothesis? Will the banana sink so it can be bowled with or float away? Gee, I don't know, Super Grover 2.0. I think a banana is kind of small, so it's going to float away, too. Yeah, float away. That's my hypothesis. Well, my super brain predicts that it will sink. But let's just test our hypotheses. <laughs> a flying banana. A floating banana, Super Grover 2.0. Despair! We shall continue the investigation! Perhaps uh, we just need something bigger, yeah. Mm. Voila! A summer squash! <laughs> what is your hypothesis? Hmm? Do you think this bigger piece of produce will stay under or float away? Well, it's bigger than a banana, but I think it's still kind of light and will float away. Well, I, Super Grover 2.0, hypothesize that since this summer squash is bigger, it will sink and be perfect to bowl with. <laughs> mm. Let's squash that thought. Aw, let's give up, Larry. We're never going to be able to bowl. The superhero never gives up. The investigation continues. <sighs> seems to be nothing left in here. Except for this brick. Oh, well, are we gonna try it? Nah, this is just for keeping me down when I am underwater. It is otherwise useless. Oh, can I see it? I do not see the point. I mean, it's no bigger than a squash, but be my guest. Yeah. What's going on? What? what what's going on? It may not be big, but if this brick helps keep Super Grover down, I think it probably sinks and won't float. That's my hypothesis. Let's check it out. It's safe. Uh, down, boy. Down, boy. Oh, oh. Oh, there must be something else in there. Aha! Ah, uh, no. It's just another couple bricks that help keep me down. Oh, we'll take them. Oh, yeah, sure. Go ahead. Knock yourself out. But not again. Okay, Linda. Bowl away. Here it comes, Larry. Yes. Yay! We did it, Super Grover 2.0. The <laughs> bricks made perfect pins. How about what? They did? Of course they did. 
Ah! And so, Super Rover learned that size doesn't matter when figuring out what sinks or floats. All in a day's work for... Uh, all in a day's work for... <laughs> oh, Super Rover 2.0. Let's go on an underwater adventure. Come with me and explore a large shipwreck off the coast of Queensland, Australia. Let's dive in and explore. Let's look closely and see what we can find. It's a school of batfish. There's a sea turtle. A shrimp. Can you see the clownfish? There's the clownfish. Look, it's a boxer crab dancing. to explore. Cookie shark! 